Bruce Williams here at number 15 at TPC Sawgrass. It's toward the end of the day on the third day of the tournament, quarter to seven at night, and have an opportunity to talk to some of the great volunteers. There's about 70 people here. I have an opportunity to uh, talk to Jack Carroll. Jack, how are you doing today? Doing well, Bruce. How are you? Great. Uh, I come to find out, I know your name and I know your company for many, many years and found out you're a local here. How far away do you live? I live about uh, three miles down the road in Jacksonville Beach, so it's a pretty quick commute for me to come out and volunteer every day. So this is a hometown deal for you, and uh, you've been here uh, just about a week now, so every day for the last seven days or so, is that correct? I have. It's, it's, been, a, it's been a wonderful experience. Uh, it's been a lot of work and a lot of fun all at the same time. What kind of uh, tasks have they given you here as a volunteer? I know they varied from day to day, but what kind of things have you done the last seven days? Um, I basically told Clay I do anything he needs me to do, uh, fill in when he needs when he needs me to fill in. Uh, I've moved turning boards, I've grabbed a rake, I've moved ropes, I've driven around. Uh, just basically anything they need, I've told them I'm willing to do it. Well, the spirit that you have and all the other people that have volunteered here is fantastic. There's 70 some individuals that have come in and they've added to the 70 or so people that are on staff to bring it up to about 140 people and this week uh, has been fantastic. Now on a side note, uh, you have done another service here. Uh, your company and another company have been supporters, have been back behind all the things that make life better, better for the volunteers. My understanding is that uh, your company has sponsored a lot of the food and a lot of the lunches and uh, possibly some of the things that have made life easier for the volunteers while they're there. Can you comment on that? Yeah, Clay and Tom uh, came to me and asked for help uh, raising money for the volunteer program. Uh, and part of my job at Harold's is to make these guys successful. And part of making them successful is making this week run smoothly. And make, uh, part of making this week run smoothly is making sure they have volunteers, uh, not only just any volunteers, top-notch volunteers from all over the world. Uh, and so supporting these guys is just a simple way that uh, we at Harold's can help these guys out to make them more successful and make this week run smoother. Well, you do all the right things, and Harold's is a well-known brand, not just here in Florida, but all the way through the Midwest of the United States. And uh, I'm sure you're proud to be a part of that legacy and that family that produces such fine products and services to people out there. So any other things that you think you might uh, undertake here before the tournament's over tomorrow and maybe get a little bit of time to watch a few players? Well, that's about it tomorrow. We're gonna be out here bright and early at five in the morning, helping out where we can. And uh, then after that, it's just enjoying the day, uh, hoping the rain holds off and uh, enjoying some good golf. All right, we're here again with Jack Harrell from the Harrells. Thanks so much for all you do for the tournament and for the game of golf. Thanks, Jack. Thank you, Bruce.